Hello and welcome, this is Al from Open Source Channel. This is a new episode on how to. Today I'm going to talk about Template Monster and how to get started with one of their premium templates. This episode has been brought to you by Template Monster, where they have provided me a free copy on one of the WordPress premium templates. If you follow the entire tutorial, uh, at the end of this video, I'm going to give you a voucher code who will give you a 10% discount on the templates. There are many templates on the Template Master website. There is a section on the CMS where there are over about 300, 300 and something um, elementary templates. These are templates and the layouts are all being done by using Elementor. Here is the Imperial Multipurpose Corporate uh, WordPress theme, the one they have provided me free of a charge for me to do this tutorial. It has a multiple layouts that you can actually try. You can find a blog, presentations, is even for e-commerce and has multiple premium plugin included, including Jet Menu and uh, Slight Revolution. This particular where template comes with an enormous amount of plugins, including the Sherry Wizard plugin that will help you to install Template Monsters templates on WordPress. Now, without any delay, let's start to go to the account. So here, once you purchase your template, you go to the download section where you can actually download your template to get started. Once you are uh, your, or you unzip your file that you receive or you download it, um, you can start the installation. Now I got a fresh copy of WordPress installed on my local server where I'm going to start and install the free plugin uh, Sherry Wizard. So I'm going to the upload plugin, choose file, and once you unzip your main file, you will find the the main file underneath there with the code there, 6226, I think it was 62626, in this particular template. That's a very important number to remember. And then the Cherry Dim Wizard. I'm going to install it and I'm going to activate the plugin. So now we can start the installation of the template by adding the template ID and the order ID. Now the number I told you earlier on, 62626, for this particular uh, template, as you can see here. So I'm going to copy this one here. Of course you can find over here as well on the right side. And I'm going to add in a template ID. Now all you need to do is going to go to the download and under the order you got the order number. Of course this one is uh, hided for a security reason. And I'm going to add mine and I get started with the installation. So I'm going to press inst uh, start install. And I'm going to wait until its installation is finished. It's going to go through different stages. Uh, this part is being um, sped up a little bit, about four times, to ensure the actual uh, tutorial is as short as possible. Here we go, the template has been done. Now we're going to continue with the parent template or use a child theme. This one comes with the child theme, so I'm going to use the child theme and I'm going to press start. The installation started. Now I'm going to cho choose the skin, the one I want to install. There are, as I said earlier on, a few of them. I'm going to go in there, have a look at the Imperium main one. This is all the recommended plugins that are going to be installed with this layout, and I'm going to have a look at the demo. 
You can actually have a look at all the demos that you want there before you do the installation, if you wanted to. There we go, it's been loaded. So this is what it looks like the uh, Imperium layout. Now, this is just not one page. It has a multiple page and it also has a store using WooCommerce. So this is what I'm going to choose and I'm going to press start install. This is all the plugins, the uh, required plugins and also the recommended. I'm going to choose all of it and I'm going to press next. And there we go, the installation started. As I said, uh, I have sped up a little bit the uh, installation. So uh, it shouldn't take that long. It does take quite a few minutes to finish, all right? It's not something of a couple of minutes. So now it's asking if I want to append the, the new content to the existing one or I want to replace it with the the one that's already on the system. This is a new installation, so I could use append if I want to, but I'm going to choose replace the, my existing content with the new demo content. Also, you can actually skip the installation altogether by choosing the third option. I'm going to press next. And the second part of the installation has started. This is what is going to install all the posts, uh, images, pages, the media, and all the rest. So the installation is nearly finished. After this, uh, the data has been imported, the regeneration of the thumbnails started. That's to ensure the optimization of the website. That is fast. There you go. That's done. Now we've got two choices. One is to view the site and the other one is to customize your site by adding the logo and the rest. Now for this tutorial, I'm going to leave it as it is. I'm not going to change the logo or anything else. This is the first page, as you can see, that has been imported properly. This is the menu pages, features, news, and of course the shop, as I mentioned. I'm going to show you the store side of it. Again, this is run by uh, WooCommerce plugin. And it also comes with the many, uh, the actual jet form uh, Elementor plugin. So you got extra um, widgets for WooCommerce. There we go. This is done in a few minutes and without any effort. This is the beauty with Template Monster. It comes fully packed with premium plugins together with the actual premium templates. And it's very simple, easy to install. We have a look at the uh, single product page, how, well, how it looks like it. Here we go. We go back and have a look a little bit of uh, slider revolution. This is the premium plugin. Of course, you need to register. In this tutorial, I haven't done so, but it'll, it comes free with the this particular template of course depends which templates you're going to buy it might not come in with it and again this is again all the uh, templates that comes with the this uh, sorry this the, all these layouts that comes with it again you can actually change uh, if you want to you're not happy with this one you want to change layout just go and append or you can replace it it's up to you and again as i said earlier on you can actually look at the demos Let's have a look at the other demonstration about the store. This is a natural layout for an e-commerce store. It's quite nicely done. The design is really good. As you can see, it's quite clean. And this is for a fashion 
e-store. Again, you can change it for whatever niche you really need. I'm going back to the template the monster website. What I have uh, promised you, I'm going to give you 10% code, a uh, coupon code. This is the actual coupon. So if you go to the um, template uh, monster website and add open source channel 10, you will get 10% off your next purchase for the template. Right guys, everything for today. Thanks again for following me this with this tutorial about template the monster. Don't forget to share, subscribe and like my videos. And I'll see you next time.